Hey everyone, welcome back to Is Your Six Covered? And I'm going to do a quick video on turning a fusee or a road flare into stormproof matches. I'm not sure if it's going to work. This will be the first time I've ever tried it. I haven't even looked on YouTube to see if someone else has tried it. But it's got a lot of good stuff in here. The material inside here will burn at 1400 degrees. So if we can get our stormproof matches that we're going to make, um, ignite this. We're going to have the possibility of generating a, a lot more heat so uh, so we can get some of that kindling that may be wet or whatever. So before we get the video started and before I show you guys um, the test on whether it works or not, if you're not familiar with the Road Flare or Fuse Z, this is 20 minutes long. You can buy these at Walmart and stuff like that in the auto section. If there's an accident, you can light these. But some of the, the positive and negative things about these are they need to be stored in a dry area. They're, this is all paper right here, waxed. And they can kind of start crumbling up and falling apart and making a mess. Things to think about too is you have the ability to cut, you could cut these and shorten them to turn them to five minutes, 10 minutes long and just put them in your backpack, tape the end so the, the, the material doesn't fall out and make a mess. But here's how it works. You basically take the cap off. You have a striker in right here like you would for matches and then you have an end that's uh, easy to ignite and you would strike this always strike this away from you so that the material like I said 1400 degrees that stuff's not coming and getting in your eyeballs or burning your shirt now the, the the negative things is if you do use one of these be very careful as the slag stuff will burn you can burn through your shoes depending on the type of material they're made out of your shirt uh, they can get in your eye you know they, they have a very pungent odor basically sulfur so you don't want to breathe the material when you're trying to ignite to make a fire uh, if you are to use one of these on the road some of the things you can think about are you put these on the other side as this is burning and if you put the cap back on it has that little nub where you would normally use it to open it that helps it to stay in the road and not roll off into the weeds and start a vegetation fire now for some reason you wanted to add on to this, you would just lay the next one, this end here of the next one around here. So as it did burn, it would, it would ignite this one and continue to burn. But for today, we're going to try to make weatherproof uh, matches out of normal matches wrapped in toilet paper with the, the ingredients in here to uh, basically sprinkle it around as we wrap that toilet paper around the match. Do I know if it's going to work? No, but you know what? Nothing works until you try it. So it's good to know whether we win or lose on this one, but uh, stay tuned and let's see how it does. Thanks again. Make sure to subscribe. Take care for now.